Okay, welcome back. We're still exploring ScreenFlow 4 here and looking at some of the new features. And I was working on this screencast, which basically shows how to place an ad listing on Kijiji or Craigslist. Okay, you can see my webcam shot here, but you'll also see that in the background, well, I have this kitchen fan, which uh, got caught in the webcam shot. And if we press play, you'll see that it's moving. It's part of the webcam. It's a little bit visually distracting. So before there was really nothing you could do about that. In ScreenFlow 4, there is, and it's called cropping. Cropping is found in the video properties, and all you have to do is toggle down. You can actually adjust now the size of a shot. So I'm actually lowering this from the top down. I would post an ad on Kijiji. Need to getting a and good that one I did not. On Craig. So here you can see the difference getting between the one I adjusted and the one I did on not. Craig. So actually, we might as well just take the rest of them. And we'll adjust them down as well. Put it down to the same level. Now I remove the overhead fan from my webcam shot and I can go ahead and edit the rest of my screencast. You can do this with your entire screencast too. I'm just selecting a different track. Let's just say for example that I wanted to remove my hard drive information from my screencast. Well I'm just going to crop from the right side and drag it in and that's it. Then I might want to rearrange my webcam as well. However you like to use it, it just adds another level of flexibility. So there you go, that's cropping, another one of the handy new features in ScreenFlow 4. Add your comments below if you like, and if you want to subscribe to the ScreenFlow tutorial series, sign up at combocasting.com. See you next time. Ciao.